Healing of the Canoe, Metaphor for Life For thousands of years, the indigenous people of the Pacific Northwest depended on the traditional dugout canoe for fishing, hunting, travel, and all aspects of life. The canoe was the foundation of Northwest Native culture and brought families and communities together to sing, dance, celebrate, share stories, trade goods, and develop important social networks and kinship ties that are still present today. Today, there is an annual canoe journey that gathers tribal nations from as far as southern Alaska to northern California, including the Inner Sounds and Mainland First Nations people. It is a significant cultural event that unites and strengthens today's generation of Native communities. The purpose of the canoe journey is first to honor our ancestors and secondly to learn and continue traditional customs that promote self-discovery and cultural revitalization. The canoe journey has been an important revitalizing force that continues to keep our culture alive and strong through protocols and traditions set in place by our ancestors. Some of the cultural reviving we have seen stemming from Canoe Journey has included the return of traditional songs, dances, storytelling and regalia, and the strengthening of our tribal languages, numerous art forms, ceremonies, and celebrations. The traditional practice of generosity through gifting, sharing, and humbly receiving has naturally returned with these traditions. In the Skalalan language, the word tenihutang means medicine for the soul. It is what many people say they feel from participating in tribal canoe journeys. It provides a sense of renewal, cleansing, healing, and feeling uplifted and encouraged. The waterways traveled each year are often referred to as the traditional highways of our ancestors, and through these journeys we are following in their footsteps, literally. One elder wrote, We see the canoe journey as a vehicle for the rediscovery of ourselves and the ways of our ancestors. The Healing of the Canoe Project has used the canoe journey as a metaphor for life to teach youth the skills needed to navigate through life without being pulled off course by alcohol or other drugs. With tribal culture, traditions, and values as compass and anchor. Youth can relate the skills needed for a successful canoe journey to their personal life journey, such as the importance of healthy relationships, balance, communication, planning, preparation, and teamwork. It is our belief that learning about and utilizing the many strengths, resources, and cultural ties of our Native people, we can combat and continue to prevent the pressures of substance use and abuse among our youth. It is our hope that other tribal communities will be able to adapt this culturally grounded, skill-based curriculum to fit the needs of their community by identifying a meaningful cultural metaphor of their own for outreaching and implementing with their youth and families.